Hello, hello. I just got home and I am hangry, but I wanted to film this on boxing on enveloping of my Pixels kit. This is from the restock and I hope they do more restocks because there is a lot of art that I really loved, but it wasn't in stock, but have no fear. I'm sure they'll be doing some restocks. So if you haven't heard of Pixels, I have a couple videos about them already. I'll link them in the description box below, but let's get into this. So this is a Canadian company, which is awesome because I'm located in Edmonton, Alberta, which is in Canada. I really enjoy doing this craft and I found a new way. So if you don't like using the applicators, uh, which are tweezers basically, you can watch my hack video to see how you can do it with a diamond painting pen. And I am a diamond painter. So anyways, fast forward, you're like, just open your kit. Okay, so let's see what we have in here. I think, oh, yay, okay, cool. So we have our little uh, promotional postcard. Oh my goodness, this is really pretty. So I think this is probably like, a pixels kit. I don't really know. Maybe I'm wrong, but this artwork is really cute. It's a little forest. And then on the back, we have thank you so much for your continued support. And I hope you enjoy these even more than the OG ones, little heart, and then instructions on how to pixel. And then if you click here, it will take you to the discord, which I have joined the pixel discord. If you haven't already, you can scan this or go find the information on their website. I'll have everything linked below. So these are the two that I ordered. I'll put them on the screen right now. Um, let's take a look at, oh, this is, I did not order this. Excuse me, excuse me. I think that they included some freebies. So let's check out the freebies first. Okay. Oh my goodness, that's so nice. Thank you so much. Ah. Okay, so I'm guessing this is a watermelon. So basically what you do, if you've never seen a pixel kit, it's very similar to diamond painting, cross stitch, etc. but you're doing everything with these vinyl stickers. They're really easy to place. They are easy to, if you place them down wrong, because I am not, I am not a perfect placer, okay? Let's just get that out of the way. Um, but they're really easy to like reposition. And then, so once you're done, like this whole area here, you can peel up the entire canvas or whatever you want to call it. And it's a sticker. So that's really cute. Thank you so much. So that's a watermelon. And then this one is a ruby. And I know that because it says right here, ruby. So this one's eight colors. And see, you can see like the canvas or the sticker part, whatever you want to call it. The sticker area is very clear. Like it's very easy to read. They don't use symbols or anything. It looks like it's all just numbers. And then this one is a cherry, oh my God, cherry cheesecake. Am I going to want to eat a cheesecake after doing this one? Probably. And this one is 23 different colors. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to see how those will turn out. And I don't own any pixel stickers yet. So this is like my first order of pixel stickers and they have like large canvases. So if you find that you really get into the craft, there's larger canvases you can try out. Okay. So this is, this is what I ordered. So this is the cottage core. I'll put on the screen here what that looks like. Isn't it adorable? Oh my goodness. When I saw this one, I was like, I know I need to have this one. So here is the cottage core uh, sticker sheet. And I was like, how do I know which one's which? But it actually says right here, cottage core. And then at the bottom, it says cottage core as well. So you won't get these sticker sheets mixed up if you do store them separately, whatever. I really like the colors on this one. Oh my goodness. This is like literally it is uh, Friday today. So this is going to be my weekend plans. What are you doing this weekend? I'm going to be pixeling. Okay, I'm annoying. Sorry. And then this one is called Sweet Treats. I'll also put on the screen right here what this one is. Isn't it pretty? Oh my goodness. This is going to make me want to eat everything. So this one actually has two, two sheets of stickers. So again, it says sweet treats up here and then it's just stapled up here. This one's 67 different colors. You guys can check out the colors. So you can see that they're pre-cut squares and then you just put them down on the colors. And I've learned since joining the Pixels Discord that a lot of people do them row by row. And I know as diamond painters, 
we kind of like section off our canvases and then we put down all of the same color in that section. But with pixels, I'm going to try it this time because my last pixels, which was an OG kit, and I know that the grid area has changed or whatever since then, um, my placement was okay, but I'm going to try and do line by line because seeing the finishes in the Discord, I'm just like, okay, I want like the perfect sticker. And like, again, so you finish doing uh, one of the stickers and then the whole entire thing lifts off. And this is, wow, this is actually like really thick. I don't, you guys probably can't tell that it's thick through the camera, but like feeling it, it's like a vinyl sticker pretty much. And then the back is just plain. If you're wondering what a completed pixels kit looks like, uh, I actually completed this one. So this is one of the original kits that they ever released and it's called Cotton Clouds. And this was sent to me to unbox on my channel and show, um, but I finished it last week. And this again was one of the original kits. So I know that the, the canvas or like the sticker area has changed since then and they've upgraded some things. Um, and I am bad at placement, okay? I know, I know, I'm bad. I'm gonna try that row by row method, as I mentioned before. Um, and for this one, I just did it color by color, but I'm pretty proud of the job that I did on this one. And um, don't worry about, uh, like if you mess up or whatever and have to like throw one of the little squares away because look at how much I have left. So you get just, you have enough squares. Oops, you have enough squares. Uh, you have enough extra just in case you do mess up. So I do have a lot left over. And again, I use that diamond painting pen method in my previous video if you wanna go check that out. But these, like I had a lot of fun doing this one. So I'm really, really looking forward to checking out these new kits, honestly, like, and the designs are so cute. I love the artists that she's chosen to work with. Everything is licensed, so you don't have to worry about stolen art or anything like that. Here, we'll take another look again really quick. And then this one was the cherry cheesecake, the ruby, and the watermelon. Have you tried Pixels before? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm very curious. Is this something you want to try? In my opinion, I just really like the idea of like a sticker because it's like I'm going to put stickers on the sticker and then I'm going to use the sticker and put it on my journal, my planner, my diary, probably even my laptop or my computer monitor. I just love the idea and I really love the artwork that they've been bringing in. Um, I'll have all the links in the description box below if I haven't said that already so make sure you check them out and make sure you hit the subscribe button. I am primarily a diamond painting channel, but I will upload more videos about pixels because I think I'm literally obsessed with them and I think I'm going to do an order on Monday, so don't tell anyone. Um, but thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye!